Good evening. Can you can you hear me? I hear you perfectly, Oscar. Oh, okay, okay. How Thank are you. you? I'm okay. Good. I'm all right. How was the weekend? Intense weekend. <laughs> <laughs> was an intense weekend. Okay. Is, it, is there a, um, a alerta roja call in El Salvador? Yeah, yeah. It's already yeah. there. It's yeah, it's, a, ra it's, it's raining. A, yeah. Yeah, I, I saw on the, uh, somebody put it on Facebook that we are on red uh, alert. Okay. Yeah, so, and apparently it's already raining in Honduras, you know. Uh, okay. okay. It's, it's creating uh, problems with rivers and, and, and things like that. So, I see. we'll see what happens here in El Salvador. Oh, no, I don't, I dislike this, this, I mean, this situation in, in which we have, we are having two hurricanes that actually are not passing through El Salvador, but right but uh, there's a lot of rain a lot of rain yeah. at least uh two weeks at least at least but uh, but if the if the the storm passes exactly through el salvador i mean because now it's just a hurricane yeah hurricane. and then entering uh making a landing fall it will become a it will be it, it will become will, it will become a storm a tropical storm and the storm, in my opinion, is gonna last three weeks. My goodness, weeks. yeah. In my opinion, uh -huh. yeah. So I'm currently in the in the U.S. I I travel. Oh, you're in the U.S. Uh, right now. I'm in there right now. Oh. I travel the Sunday. On oh. Sunday. What part of the U.S. Uh, are you in? Uh, Chicago. Chicago. Um, I'm visiting my my mother. Good. And oh, she lives there. Uh huh. She lives here, and and you know, here here there's a quarantine. Yeah, quarantine. It's a quarantine. Quarantine. Um, no, the restaurants are closed. Only delivery. Lo deja fuera, dígale. Okay. Hello. Only the you, the the there's only deliveries. The the parks and public places are closed. Yeah. But it's not, uh, I mean, it's not an obligation here. I mean, right. Uh, you can go anywhere, but it's a, it's a quarantine in, in which you, if you want, uh, you will do that. Okay. Actually, actually, the problem is that I've seen people here without mask. If, and, and people really don't, I mean, they are. They're like whatever. Many people don't, don't believe, uh, many people don't believe, actually. Right. Right, a, right, uh -huh. true. It's a pandemic, uh -huh. this, is a, this is another, I mean. And, and that's why they're losing, world. that's why they're losing a lot of people, you know, because they're like, oh, uh -huh. I don't need a mask, I don't need a mask. Wrong, everybody needs a mask. All right, good. In the airports? Uh -huh, okay, okay, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, what, what happened with the airports? No, it's an obligation. In the U.S. airports, yeah. it's an obligation yeah. to, to wear a mask. Right. But, uh, ex exiting the airports, you, you see people it's like optional um, yeah it's like optional all right good so okay well enjoy your stay in the u.s i will, I will. all right good okay everybody welcome back Irene, oscar roxy rocio julia it's good to see you again uh, before i forget i will mention this at the end of the session but like you received uh a, a message from Inglés Corporativo, and I wrote you in the morning too, that we have until Thursday at 12 midnight uh, to complete uh, all the platform. So anybody that hasn't finished the platform on Thursday at 12 midnight will not be part of the following level. So I suggest that, uh, that you guys start working on it if you are still having pending work. And if you have questions, uh, let me know and uh, and I'll be more than glad. Um, it's better if you ask me questions in the morning, which is when I have uh, 
uh, I, I'm usually in front of the computer. In the afternoon, I start working, let's say at 3.30, I start planning my classes and I start teaching at 6 p.m. So after 4 p.m. is a little bit difficult for me to reply like instantly. So keep that in mind. All right, so any questions about last class? Julia, do you have any questions? I don't even remember the topics we talked about. <laughs> okay. Any questions, anybody else? So far, so good. What is it? So far, so good, teacher. Thank you. All right, good. All right, so let's begin. Um, let's give a few more minutes to the ones that are still uh, on their way to connecting. Let me assign you to work in pairs and talk about the things you guys did on the weekend. So, let's do it like this. And here we go. Just talk about your weekend and pay attention to the, to the ED pronunciation in the simple past. Here we go. Hello, Roxy. And you, how was your weekend? Fine. Uh, on a Friday, I went to the beach. I, sp I spent the night there, uh, to the Tunco Beach. Uh, oh, that's great. Yeah, but the hotel was too expensive for what we got. Um, yeah, a little expensive. I expected more. Oh. Um, yeah. What's the yeah. name of the hotel? Uh, Roca Sunsal. Okay. Ah, okay. It's too expensive for uh, for everything. Really? Yeah, the food was great. Um, the breakfast, oh my God, it's better the eggs that I cooked here in my. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. It's re really, I was like like uncomfortable, and uh, when the waiter came to us and asked, and and he asked. Hey, how was how was your, your breakfast? Did you like it? I said I couldn't uh, stay Call like. It. Yeah, and I told him that it was too poor for for the price that we paid. Right. No, right. but the, the beach the beach uh, in this in uh, these days with a lot of stones in the mm -hmm. in the in the beach. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, we spent a, a great time a great time, and uh, in the at Friday night, we went to a restaurant. The name was Cacos, a delicious pizza. I really like it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. yeah that's great. Yeah. I, I, yes, I, I think it's incredible that people eat, eat the people eat pizza on the beach. <laughs> but there is a lot of people eating pizza. At lunch, at low uh, for the original trajectory. Oh my goodness, um, we needed uh, to prepare for, for them, right? Yes, for them, for us too, because if the, the changes in the trajectory increase or decrease in this, in our case, decrease in the, in the out territory, 
uh, we had a, a difficult in the in the in the few days. Uh, the, the people working with us in Honduras uh, receive a notify today in the afternoon. They need to return uh, their house at uh, 3 p.m. because many people live in shelter. And then they need to assure that their mm -hmm. position mm -hmm. and another person, uh, I, I don't know is a, a correct uh, information, but they said they uh, need to reubicate because uh, the shelter ubication, actual ubication was a dangerous, uh, a dangerous or, or can be a risk. Right. Oh in your case, affect your enterprise, right? Yes, but because in the in our case, as a company, all that textile location uh, are in uh, are, uh, I don't know is the correct why are on Honduras. What is it? Uh, están in Honduras. Are on they Honduras. are in Honduras? They have they are in, on Honduras, and all the uh, clothes received from there. And if they don't work, we don't have that cloth. And I imagine. then we we can risk to to continue uh, working in that next day. Oh my goodness! Yeah. And also, uh, also today said one bridge had a problem. Uh, the bridge connect the El Salvador to Honduras in the terrestrial uh, land. Uh huh. In, in, if the, I don't want to say caudal, in the, the depth, the depth for the river increase uh, for, for a, a specific uh, level, uh, that bridge, bridge had a, a issues. Right. Yeah. I was reading some news that, you know, uh, uh, the river overflowed already uh, yes. and it's only like the beginning of, of the storm. I imagine in your case it's the same because in in the case of the Nehapa situation, uh, the the comp the government only clean the land on the on the street, but in they don't working in in the order work to reduce the risk if the continuous uh, rain. Right. And then if the rain is a lot. Of in this place, continuous roll out the, the land. Right, and right. This is very, very dangerous. Yeah. Hopefully, uh, you know, uh, things are not going to be serious uh, in the area. Yeah. Hopefully. All right. I was, I was helping to 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 do some services here in the in my house like cleaning mm -hmm. or something to to cut the grass was very hard <laughs> because the Saturday was uh, hot the temperature was very yeah, yeah. hot but yeah. it was great and on the afternoon and mm -hmm. we went to to eat pupusa with my family mm -hmm. and and just uh, when we were in the, in the pupuseria just we have to 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 pick up because we couldn't be <laughs> there because we were a little scared because oh. it was a, a little full. Uh, a lot uh, of people. A lot of people there. Oh. So oh. we had to pick up. Yes, we we did outside on my in my yard. <laughs> Good. Good. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah because it, it you know. Was, uh -huh, go ahead. Because uh, we couldn't to to arrange or to take the risk. Yeah, mm -hmm. we, we didn't take it because uh, we we were a little uh, afraid because it was the first time we we were to go out. Oh really? To eat, to, yes. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. But the next the next day on Sunday we went la Gran Villa and so we we ate. There in sushi. All right. Mm -hmm. okay. And sushi yeah. too. Yes. Mm -hmm. But it's the first time we were a little 
nervous. Yeah, it's normal. <laughs> if it's your first time, you know, like you're you're nervous and you know, like you don't feel completely well or safe. Uh, yes, it's a, a big problem. Right. In Nicaragua is, is the hurricane is arrived, yeah. Yeah, Honduras. The... In Nicaragua too, I guess. Okay. I'm, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure. I, I'm not sure, but I think that I saw a video of Nicaragua and uh, it looks like tough. Yeah. Yeah, so make your laundry tomorrow. <laughs> right. You know, I hadn't thought about that. I'm going to tell my wife because it's true. <laughs> I mean, like, imagine if we get a lot of rain, your clothing will be wet all the time. Yeah, I did it today by morning. Right, right. You know, I, I hadn't thought about that. So I'm going to, I will tell my wife to take uh, action. Yeah, it's necessary. Yep, yep. Yes. <laughs> it's gonna, um, when the afternoon, no, probably Thursday, right? To El Salvador, or the hurricane. Uh, yeah, Wednesday or Thursday, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's, uh, hopefully it's not going to be anything serious. Hopefully. Yeah. All right, let's go yes. back to the main session. Okay. Okay, thank you. All right. Let's wait for the others to return. They should be here right now. They're coming back in 40 seconds. All right, um, any questions or comments on how to use, uh, uh, any questions or comments about your weekend, about the activities that you did or the activities that are going on or the activities that will happen? No? No, teacher. All right, good. So uh, to talk about uh, conditionals, conditionals, they come in different form. How do you say, si yo me hubiera acostado temprano? You say, if I had gone to sleep early. Si yo hubiera comprado los zapatos. If I had bought the shoes. Uh, what is the tense that you're using when you're saying, if I had seen you, if you had called me, what is the name of the tense? Past participle. Past perfect. Past perfect. Past past perfect. Yeah, past perfect. So remember, we have 12 tenses in English. Every tense has a function. Every tense has a structure. Um, so the past perfect, we usually use it to talk about two events in the past that indicates which one happened first. But um, there are tenses that they have additional functions like the conditional right, right now. So how do you say, si me hubiera bañado, estaría fresco? How will you say that in English? If I, if, I taken, if I had taken a shower, I would, be, I would be fresh. Yes, I would, I would be fresh, I would be fresh right, right now. Right now. Yeah. Si yo te hubiera escuchado, estaría tranquilo. If I, if I have I listened to you, if I had listened to you, I'll be quiet. I will be relaxed. I will be okay. I will be fine. So, when you're using um, conditionals in today's case, you have to use the past perfect. What is the auxiliary we use when we use the past perfect? Um, had. Uh, had. Had. Uh, and you use uh, had for all personal pronouns. How do you say si ella hubiera venido? If she, if, had, she had, if she had come, tendríamos la cena lista. We would have a dinner. 
we would have hey, dinner, dinner ready. Don't. Okay. Dinner so, ready, okay. Right. So once again, to talk about that conditional in particular, you have to start with the uh, past perfect. And then the complement, you use would. Si hubieras planchado esa camisa, no estaría hot. How would you say that? <laughs> If you had iron the shirt, if you had iron the shirt, it wouldn't be wrinkle. Wrinkle, very good. Wrinkle. Yes. So if you had iron that shirt, it wouldn't be wrinkle. Yes. Now remember that wrinkle means ajado, and it also means um, arrugas. Arrugas, right. Right. So it can be like a napkin. You wrap it after it's wrinkled. But it's also like uh, like if you analyze someone that is 85 years old, the skin of this person is wrinkled. Right. So wrinkle mm -hmm. makes reference to material or also the skin. Any questions? No. Okay, so let me write, um, so if, if you had ironed, ironed that shirt, it wouldn't be <coughs> wrinkled. I don't remember if wrinkle is with uh, CK or only K. Can somebody uh, refresh um, my memory? K. Only, only K. Only K, 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 huh? Okay. K yeah. So if you had ironed that shirt, it wouldn't be wrinkle. Si hubieras planchado esa camisa, no estaría ajada. Okay. So I want you to go back in life maybe 10 or 15 years ago and talk about the things you wish you yeah, had my... changed. So in my case, if I had listened to my mom, I would be, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh -huh. but, so you said, if, if I had done this, if I had worked over time, if I had sent you the email, so just talk about uh, uh, the things you wish could be different by using that. Let me recreate, recreate. Okay. Have rooms. We will move to room seven. Move to room seven. All right. So everybody has a partner. Let's do this. If I had listened to my mom, if I had listened to my teacher, if I hadn't gone Esa sí hay que llevarla para arriba. Estos niños la han agarrado de juguete. Bueno, Mary, if I had listened to my mom, I, I could be alone. I couldn't get married. Okay. <laughs> I had it. You regret about a job that you took that you uh -huh, that you took like two years ago, and I quit for my previous job, and my boss was like, uh, "Think about it, think about it," and <laughs> and I regret about that. So, and how long had... how long have you worked there? I worked there for a for a year and a half. It's uh, not much. Don't worry. You're a teacher, yeah. right, Diana? No, I'm not. You're not. No. Okay. No, I 
I am an uh, yeah, I'm an, an engineer, an industrial engineer. Okay. Yes. But I regret about that because my boss told me if I had listened to him, I hadn't taken, I wouldn't taken that job. That it was really awful. <laughs> and did you return to your previous job where you quit? No, 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 I have. No, I, I didn't. I didn't. Okay. I didn't. <laughs> All right. I didn't want it to be illegal. Uh, my um, I didn't you want return, it. So. Did you return at the country? Mm -hmm, I returned to Salvador. Uh, I, I traveled to the United States because I had a relative in there. But you what? You I, had what? A relative living oh, okay. in, in the United States. But mm -hmm. I don't like it live on the on, in the United States because the the kind mm -hmm. of thing is very difficult for for the illegal person or for um, uh, people don't don't have a study uh, English or uh -huh, in, in a second language too because uh, the um, the people for uh, support their life in there need to work a lot. Sí, and, yeah. and I live better in my country <laughs> with the, the health or the, or the sport. Yeah. Yeah, Even, yeah, yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, Oscar. No, 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 Norma was about to say something. Yeah, Norma? No, I, I, I use my, my, my opinion about it, the living in the United States. Ah. Oh. So for me, yeah, it's more for case. the people to uh, study in there and, and board in there and have a, a all, all opportunity similar to the American person in, in that country. But mm -hmm. if you travel from one, one country to that and, and stay, start as an illegal person, no, nah, it's very difficult. Even if you are legal, yeah, even even yes. if you speak good English, you know, like races oh, really? yes. will always read ah, right. sooner or later. So, yeah, now imagine if you are illegal and do not speak any English, it will be way harder no. for you. Yeah. Uh -huh. In my case, I did. I didn't want to to stay as a as a illegal as an illegal migrant. Uh, because uh, I I was given a student visa. Okay. Uh, despite uh, despite the fact that it was a short time, a period of time, one year, only one year. But uh, I didn't want it to 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 how to say stink or to. Yeah. I didn't want to screw my my record. All right. I didn't I didn't want because I was I was given a a student visa. So. Right. Right. It's the way it is, but some people... What? Or teenager. Um, teenager, okay. Yes. Uh, yes. When I was teenager, um, um, let me see. Um, what do you say penosa in, in English? Uh, shy, embarrassed. Embarrassed. I was... I was uh, very embarrassed, embarrassed uh -huh. when I was when I was a, a teenager because okay. because I I um different different topics uh, for the for example um the others um, the others friends and male. Female is I. Male is uh, the my friends. I I am embarrassed with my friends uh, when as I was teenager. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you, uh, Carmen? Uh, in my case, I ha I was a uh, a teenager like uh, friendly. Uh -huh. and, 
and 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 I think uh, I don't I don't I don't change anything about my life. For me, my uh, life is is good. Nice. Yes, me too. I don't change in the housewives at home. <laughs> Mama de casa. Yes. Housewife. 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 Yes. yes. And mm -hmm. we have a, a lot of activities to do. And for yeah. men, it's different. Mm -hmm. I think so. <laughs> yes, I think. Uh, yes, and you, Irene, that, what do you think? I think that, that uh, when we had a, a child, uh, mm -hmm. or fathers, uh, or parents, right? Uh, mm -hmm. Says uh, some advice. If um, I listen <laughs> in my case to my mom or my father, uh, I I could have uh, evitar <laughs> prevented 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 many pro thank you M many pro many problems. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. A better, a better, a better, a better way. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. in, in, in a better life. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. But, uh, mm -hmm. but it's necessary uh, also uh, to leave uh, some problem for, mm. for wrong. Okay. For wrong. In order to learn. <laughs> <laughs> Number five. Yes. <laughs> hey, teacher Francisco, we yes, have sir. we have two number five in, in the midterm exam. What do you mean? <laughs> we don't have a, a question number six. After five, we have another five. Really? It, yes. it, is, is it the same question repeated? No. Different, just the number. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, you know, the, the platform has um, some issues, you know, that yes. whoever was doing the work, you know, they, they made a mistake. So I don't know who, who wrote me today, you know, asking for help. And I said, uh, look, this is this is the answer that I that I'm that I'm putting. And his answer was good, and I said, look the platform does have mistakes so so i gave this person the the, the right uh, answer but his answer was good but the platform didn't recognize it as such so yeah, i said you know true. the platform has, has has mistakes so it happens yes it's, it's not the best platform but it's, it right. works. Exactly. it works exactly all right yeah, so let's go. Some proof. <laughs> yeah okay let's go back to the main session All right, all right, all right. Any questions or comments on how to use conditionals? No. All right, so uh, like I told you at the beginning of the session, uh, you guys have until Thursday at 12 midnight to finish all the exercises in the platform. Um, we need to send uh, people's report, people's score to INSA for Friday morning. And that's why uh, even if you said, okay, I, I, will, I will finish on, on, on Friday morning, it's going to be too late. So this particular time, you need to finish the platform Thursday night. Why? Because there is no vacation this time because we start this coming Monday. So uh, we finish Thursday night. Uh, we send all the reports to INSA for Friday morning and then you're officially enrolled. But that's going to happen only if you have uh, the platform completed. So keep that in mind. All right. So uh, let me see it is here. This 
Okay, can you see my screen? Yes. Yes, yes. teacher. Okay. Um, maybe you already finished this part. Maybe you haven't. Uh, we have 10 different exercises. Um, every two sentences is one exercise. So number, number two is the complement of number one. Number four is the complement of number three. So they make sense. So what would be the answer for the first one? According to the, uh, to the past perfect structure we've been practicing. Had been. If I had been. If I had been more adventurous when I was younger. Uh -huh. I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have any regrets about the things I missed. Good. Excellent. What about number three? The airline lost my luggage. If I had brought, brought, brought a change of clothes in my carry-on bag. I wouldn't shop. I wouldn't shop. Exactly. I wouldn't shop. No. This flight is so long. If I, is, bought, if, I if I hadn't bought, if I hadn't bought, if I hadn't, yeah, if I hadn't bought an economy class ticket, I would be more comfortable now. I would be more comfortable now, right? What about number seven? If you had learned, if you, if you had learned, if you had learned. learned to speak more, more Mandarin, 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 Mandarin for moving to Taipei, you would be able you to ask someone, to ask someone for directions now. Excellent. If Marta wouldn't become, became, if Marta hadn't become, hadn't be, a, flight hadn't attendant. Become a flight attendant, she probably, she probably wouldn't travel as much. Yes, as she, she probably does. wouldn't travel as much as she does. Yes. So remember, if you are not in this part yet, remember that number two is the complement of number one, number four is the complement of number three, number 10 is the complement of number nine. Any questions or comments? No? No. Okay. Um, are you guys familiar with driving licenses in the United States? Yeah. Okay. So in the driver's license, it has your name, your address, your picture, but they add something else. The license has an extra thing. Do you remember that extra thing? But a donor or something. Exactly. Like that. Exactly. So when you go get your license, they ask you, look, if you die in a car accident, can mm -hmm. we take some of your organs? If you say yes, they put a sticker uh, to the driver's license. So if there is a car accident and you're dead, you know, they check for the license and they see if you're a donor or not. If your driver's license has a sticker, they perfectly can take you to a hospital, open your body, and remove all the organs that they want. But if you say yes, while you're still alive. So um, organ transplant. So let me show you this. This conversation is going to be about uh, organ transplants. You know, some religions, they don't believe in it. Can, can you see the questions? What comes to mind? Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let, let me break up rooms, recreate, recreate. So he goes to room seven and she goes to room seven as well. Uh, Six room six. So everybody has a partner. Yes, so let's do this. 
Hello, Norma. Okay. I don't receive the invitation for the. Okay, I send you to room six. Can you try? I let me see. I don't notice the the invitation. Okay. Let me put you in room four. Can you join our uh, room four? Uh, right now, no. I don't know. I uh, I lost my 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 internet in a okay. few seconds. All right. I don't know if that. Maybe that 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 was why. So maybe you want to disconnect and come back again, please. Okay. Please. Thank okay, you. Okay, teacher. Ah, yes, that's the beautiful part of it, of being a donut, because you can save life, life, yes. with your body. Yes, and if you are not a donut, at the end your organs are, are going to be like rotting, rotting, I don't know. In yeah, the they, will <laughs> they will rot. They will rot. True. <laughs> So, yes, I would like to, yeah. to be a, a, an organ donor. Teacher, did, you, don't, you didn't send the, the picture to the group, right? Oh, let me... Um, okay, give me a second. Okay, thank you. All right. So what organs can be transplanted or donated? Mm, I think heart. Yeah. Lungs. Lungs. Okay. Uh, um, I, I, I don't know how do you say riñones? Kidneys. Kidneys. Uh, kidneys. Yes. The liver. Liver. Yes. Yeah, the kidneys, the liver. Mm. I think that in some countries you can do even uh, donate too. your skin. Yeah. Your skin, right? And eyes too. Your eyes, eyes too. Ah, yes. the eyes. Yes. True. Yep. Yeah, and like Diana was saying, you know, like if you die, your organs will will go rotten. You know, like they will disappear. Mm -hmm. The worms will eat it. So you might as well do something productive with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, I was talking with Diana and Cecilia, uh -huh. uh, and I say uh, when, you, uh, when you are in a Dewey Centro, you fill your personal uh, information. information and you put it if you want to be a donate or not. Right. And uh -huh. And in a, no, not in a, in a I, I don't know if I put it in an ID, but in a personal information, yeah. put in 
Yes, you can put yes or not. All right. Oh, that's I, I, terrible. I listen in this uh, because uh, the people say uh, the, this funeraria <laughs> sell uh <-huh>. the organ. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh -huh. but, 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 wow, bad quality. I mean, no, not a good quality because if, if the funerary, I mean, I, I think uh, there are few hours the, after you die, uh, the, the if you are a donor, you the I mean the you have few hours to donate your organs. I mean, uh, I don't know how long. I don't know how long. Uh, I, I I don't know if if it's possible to. Yes, I'm not I, sure about it. The next yeah, one. I had hepatitis when I was like three or five. I don't remember, but I'm not sure if I can donate. Okay. The next one. What organs can be transplanted? Transplanted. Translated. Translated. Trans Say it again, teacher, please. Transplanted. Trans Transplanted. Well, the normally we listen is a um, um, heart. 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 Uh, heart. heart. Uh -huh. The number one. Liver. The liver. Um. Ah, teacher, how do you say corneas? Ah, uh, do you say, I don't know exactly, corneas. Yeah, let, but let, the corneas can be pla transplanted. Transplanted, transplanted. 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 Let, let, let me check if it's the same word, you know, like uh, when you're talking about medical stuff, um, many, many of the words are like almost the same. The same. Yes. And I think you say corneas too, but I want to confirm. Corneas. Yeah. Corneas. Yeah. Yeah, cornea. Yeah, cornea. You said cornea. Cornea. Uh-huh. So in the kidney is the younger. Yeah. Yeah. Kidney. Yeah, kidneys. Kidneys. Uh-huh. It's like kidneys. Riñones? Kidneys, yes, yeah, yes. kidneys, liver. Um, uh, 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 long, how do you say long? Long, lungs. yeah, lungs. 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 lungs, yes. Okay. And, um, you can receive, you can receive to the medulla ósea. I don't know, there is an, uh, uh, yeah, a little bit of medicine. Yeah, the No, that's the marrow bone. Marrow bone. Yeah, marrow bone. My God, I didn't know that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, I learned that marrow bone because my mom, she had a, 
she had leukemia. She had she's a leukemia survivor. So um, and that's how we got involved in all the cancer thing. You get you know? familiar with the term. Yeah. Right. Right. And I remember uh, the the bladder bone. Yep. All right. The sin, the pecado, y mm -hmm. the refuse the blood. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's a reason. It's a valid reason. I don't, I don't know how to say it. It's a valid reason, teacher. Mm. A good reason. A, a good, good reason. reason. Okay. Or you it's can also say reason. acceptable. Say it's an acceptable reason. Acceptable. Uh huh. It's an acceptable reason because right. I think that religious is really important for for people okay the next one do you think organ transplants will become much more common in the future in my case i don't think so example the, the blood but the the the, the, oh. the uh, transfusion not not just the not transfusion Ah. It, uh, uh, mm -hmm. the, the, oh, the marrow bone. Yes, marrow bone. Marrow bone. Marrow. Marrow bone. B O N E. Marrow bone. What marrow. is that? Yes. Medulla. Medulla. Ah, medulla. Medulla. Yeah. Medulla. Mar marrow bone. Marrow. Yeah, people with um with cancer, they need uh, transplants of the marrow bone. Marrow bone. Yeah. Yes. Uh, I I I say to 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 partner. Uh, mm -hmm. I I don't remember the name in Spanish. The the the. Well, what what? <laughs> Where is it located? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, besides to to a stomach is uh, the vesicula and after liver the hígado no yes <laughs> now <Nah, well. laughs> <Liver. laughs> unique but exists liver transplant yeah liver yeah, yeah, liver. yes yes I know a, a, I know a, a woman that has liver a donation of liver yes oh, but really yeah just when you mm -hmm. die but it's no 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 die. she she she, she received she received a liver from other people in in the united states of course mm -hmm. yeah yeah there there is a place in the i think it's the philippines uh, there is a town where many people, many people, they only have one, one kidney, kidney. because mm. they sell wow. the other one. Yeah, they sell it. They sell it. Yes. Yeah, they receive an amount of money. I mean, the town is so poor that the money that they receive changes their lives. So many people in, in that population, they only have one kidney. Mm. It's a good business. It is. It is. <laughs> the black market. It is very expensive. Right. Right. Yeah. No, that's too bad. I, I think. Wow. Well, hmm. uh, that's interesting. You, uh, <laughs> that's interesting. <laughs> Change your <I>, life. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have to do my All right, all right. 
Any questions or comments about the topic? Any questions about vocabulary or pronunciation? I guess not. No, thank you. All right. So uh, thank you very much. Remember, uh, start working on the platform. I know that you, some of you are already working on it. Some of you guys, I think you already finished. And uh, but but keep doing it. So I will see mm -hmm. you tomorrow, same place, same time, eight o'clock. Have a good okay. night. Have a good night. Thank, Thank you. Have a good night, teacher. Bye. See you, everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.